standing by now to receive video from the astronaut quarters of the STS-83 crew suiting up. And here we are. Here we see our commander, Jim Halsell. Here's our pilot, Susan Still, the second female pilot to fly the space shuttle. It's Janice Voss, our payload commander on this mission. Roger Crouch will be responsible for much of the science operations on board the microgravity space lab. Mike Gernhardt, mission specialist number two, and also our flight engineer for STS-83. And Don Thomas, mission specialist. Here's Greg Lynn Tiras. This is shuttle launch control at T-minus 2 hours, 37 minutes, 30 seconds and counting. The astronauts have arrived at the 195-foot level of the fixed service structure where the orbiter access arm is located. And uh, Columbia will be picking up momentarily. You guys have a great mission, and we'll see you back here in uh, about two weeks. NTD, you're clear to launch. Columbia copy. And now we'll be checking the flight controls on the orbiter, the aerial surface uh, profile test. The vehicle will go to uh, internal power in about 10 seconds. Coming up on T minus 3 minutes 23 seconds, we're now gimbling three main engines, checking their steering capability. Sequence start. Five, four, three, two, one, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Columbia with the Microgravity Science Laboratory, our research bridge to the space benefits of tomorrow. Roger, Roger roll, Columbia. Houston's now controlling. Columbia is rolling on course toward a 160 nautical mile high orbit, inclined 28 and a half degrees to our equator. Columbia already traveling 300 miles per hour. Columbia's three main engines have now throttled back to two thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. Altitude now two and a half miles, one and a half miles east of the launch pad. Columbia is traveling. 650 miles per hour. Columbia, go with throttle up. Columbia, go with throttle up. 
Columbia's three main engines now back at full throttle, all systems on board in good shape. Columbia speed now 1,500 miles per hour, altitude 12 miles. One minute 55 seconds since liftoff. Flight controller standing by in the next uh, few seconds for burnout and jettison of the twin solid rockets. Booster officer confirms good separation of the solid rockets. Columbia, performance is nominal. Speed, performance nominal. 